EU countries have continued to evacuate their citizens from Lebanon as hostilities between Israel and Hezbollah escalate. Germany flew another 130 of its citizens out of the country on board a military plane that landed in Frankfurt. The German Foreign Ministry said in a post on X that the evacuation plane also brought five tons of aid, particularly medical equipment, into the Lebanese capital. Greece also sent a military transport plane to Beirut on Thursday to bring home both Greek and Cypriot nationals who wanted to leave Lebanon. The C-130, carrying 38 Cypriots and 22 Greeks, landed in Cyprus before heading to a military airfield near Athens later in the day. Greece's foreign ministry says it's established hotlines for its citizens living in Lebanon to call if they require assistance in leaving the country. Spain evacuated the first group of its citizens on Thursday, bringing 250 people home on board two military planes which landed at an airbase near the capital, Madrid. The Spanish foreign ministry said the situation in Lebanon is so serious that part of the embassy staff will also be airlifted out of Beirut on a second plane, leaving only a skeleton staff behind to carry out essential diplomatic work. And France has also started evacuating its citizens, with the first group arriving on one of four flights that landed at Charles de Gaulle Airport in Paris. The French embassy in Lebanon has reportedly negotiated two additional flights to Paris with the Lebanese national airline MEA. Meanwhile, flag carrier Air France says it suspended all passenger flights to Lebanon until at least the 8th of October.